who are watching, this is video that just came into us. So this is unedited video. You can see people coming across the finish line there, and there is the explosion one and two. It appears almost as in they're in different places. We'll have to figure that out as we as we learn more about what happened here. But again, the explosion, the main one there at the Marathon Sports, and then you can hear after that, Paula. Mm. It's just absolutely heartbreaking to see this. This is video again just yep. coming in. You see the marathon uh, officials there reacting yes. and getting those fences back so people can get out of the way. For instance, right here in the blue jacket, that's Tommy Marr, who every year is the person who is the official there at the finish line. You can see him running off to police off with police officers to the side to assist people. We do want to warn viewers as we take a look at this. This is raw video just coming into the newsroom, and we feel that it's important to get it out there and show it to you as quickly as possible. But we have not had a chance to edit this video yet. Lisa Hughes on the scene is describing what she describes a terrible scene. Mm -hmm. People gravely injured with missing limbs, bloody heads, and they are being <clears throat> taken to the medical tent there in Copley Square and often ambulances at this point. But what a horrific scene. We